Welcome back to another episode of Daily Fortnite, your daily podcast about Fortnite. I'm your host, Mikey, a.k.a. Mike Daddy, a.k.a. Magnificent Mikey. And today they announced that Fortnite Mares is officially coming on October 18th. Tis the season of screams, bad dreams, and all monstrous things. Fort Nightmares will return on October 18th. I'm looking forward to that. Always love the Halloween themed uh, map and quests and rewards and all that good stuff for Fort Nightmares. So I'm excited for that. Also, show Shadow Midas has returned to the item shops and... You know, we'll look at that when we get to the item shop, but that's always an exciting thing. People love that outfit, right? For now, let's take a look at some of the LTMs that we can play uh, the rest of our weekend here. We have Eterna City Zombie Survival, Mystic Mansion, a Fortnite board game, Valhalla Hammer of Thor Melee Update, Midnight Props, Garden Dropper 3 Part 2, Parkour Mas Grande del Mundo, Water Park Gun Game, Survival Game Island, Ice Kingdom RPG, 1v1 Build Fight Map New, Not Bed Wars and XP No Beds, Season 1v1 and Box Fight New Update, 249 Level Parkour Run, uh... Simulator Zombies Training, and a whole lot more to be discovered in the Discover tab. We can take a look at these quests. Again, let's see here for week two. Deal damage to opponents with a legendary weapon. Uh, well, you know, this season you still have your sapling, so you can plant a sapling somewhere, uh, you know, and farm it until you get it to legendary, and that's going to guarantee you... Uh, a legendary weapon so that is one way to make sure you get legendary weapon but the other way is the you know you have a lot higher chance of getting legendary weapons out of the vaults and that is just you know again dependent on getting the keys and then going to a vault you know the vault in tilted towers uh it, i believe it takes two keys to open up that one uh but it's a highly populated area and a, a lot of loot in that area. So I find keys pretty regularly and pretty easily at Tilted Towers. And, um, you know, you can just land in that one area, find keys, and be able to open the vault without having to, like, run all over the map to find them. You know? So that's a, that's a really good place, I believe, to... Uh, you know open up the vault and have a high chance of getting legendary weapons so you might want to try that out as well uh let's see let's go ahead and head on over to the item shop and see what's in the item shop today you know we're gonna have a bunch of spooky stuff we got our uh, ripley and xenomorph uh, and all of our icon bundles still here. Uh, Iron Man Zero bundle still here. Again, all the spooky offer stuff that we've had in here the last couple of days now. And then today we added the Moxie outfit with the Moose back bling for 1,200. The Brute Gunner outfit for 800. The Star Wand harvesting tool for 800. Savor the W emote for 500. Jump around emote for 400. The Sacken emote for 200. Uh, we have the Volume 11 bundle. All right, this includes the Power Cord outfit, the Six String Back Bling, the Riot outfit, Anarchy Axe Harvesting Tool, and the Stage Dive Glider, all for 1,900. That's 2,900 off the total. You can get them separately. Power cord outfit with the six string back bling is 2000. The riot outfit is 1200. The anarchy axe harvesting tool is 800. The stage dive glider is 800. We have the rock out emote for 800. Um, oh, you know that rock out outfit is also part of the bundle. So it's 2900 off the total. Um, I already own that. Uh, 
that's in the bundle too. I didn't notice that that was also in the bundle. So I had to scroll down. Uh, but yeah, that's cool. And then again, as we mentioned, everybody's really excited about this. The Shadow Midas outfit, 1,500. It's in the item shop today. The Gordy back bling for 400. The Blood Moon Rising back bling for 400. The Guff outfit with the Fluffle Bag back bling for 1,200. Did they change his colors? I feel like he was a little bit brighter before. I feel like his colors like look a little, I don't know. They're a little bit darker. Maybe it's just my TV screen. I don't know. Uh, we have the Guffy Stuffy back bling for 400. The Regal Flu Farvesting Tool for 800. And that looks like everything today. You can get any and all these items using code Mikey, M-M-M-I-K-I-E, in the item shop. And some of the proceeds will go to help support the show. That is going to be the episode for today. Make sure you go join the daily Fortnite Discord and hang out with us. Follow me over on Twitch, Twitter, and YouTube. Head over to Apple Podcasts, leave a five-star rating and a written review for a shout-out on the show. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss an episode. And until next time, have fun, be safe, and don't get lost in the storm.